What's up guys, Cyber Houdini here and welcome to Hollow Knight. This is a game I've wanted to play for so freaking long. It's one of those I've kind of kept in uh, the back of my mind like waiting and waiting going. I need to wait and have like a little special moment to put aside to play a Hollow Knight. And it was one of those games that got kickstarted and then I think it was on Switch first or something. Yeah, I'm really sure that was it. Um, and it, it eventually came to the PS4 with the, the Void Heart edition, which uh, is all the DLC. That's the one I've got. Um, if you couldn't tell, it's a it's a 2D Metroidvania. Beautiful, beautiful hand-drawn art style, but it's supposed to be tough as nails. Like, people are putting it up there with some really tough fights. You know, like the classic, like, uh, Metroid, Metroid or, or, um, or Castlevania or even, like, there I said Dark Souls, I know everything gets compared to it, it's becoming a bit of a joke now. But I'm so happy, and with the announcement of the sequel, Hollow Knight Silk Song, which is the user character from the game, and she gets her own game or something. Um, yeah, I just I, this is right up my alley, like waiting for Ori and the Will of the Wisp, which is the Ori sequel. To, to come, this is going to definitely hold me over. And I wanted to finish off Neo, or at least put it to bed, um, so that I could like, when it comes to these kind of... You know, tougher games or, you know, Souls-like games even. I want to commit as much mental space as I can. You know, I don't want to, like, if I was playing, like, one of the Dark Souls, I don't want to be playing them all. You know, i just go, I'd go crazy. So I'm playing Bloodstain at the moment, which is, uh, you know, a spiritual successor to Castlevania Symphony of the Night. And it's so good. It's everything I've ever wanted in a Castlevania. I didn't even know that I needed it as much. Like, as soon as I finish playing Bloodstained, I just want to play more, and I know Hollow Knight is going to be the same. I've watched a little bit of this, um, and yeah, a lot of people, it's got a, a lot of nice, like, con confusing things in it, which is always great, like, a lot of anyone else would go, this is too confusing or whatever, but I think that's the beauty of it, and it's supposed to have lower to back itself up, like, to the level that, um, the Dark Souls games go, so I can't, I can't wait, I've been calling this, uh, Bug Souls, which is so funny. So as far as all I know about the story is that we play as this little guy, this little hollow knight, uh, and we are trapped down in this massive uh, nest that we have to get the hell out of. But it's beautiful. There's something very gothic about it, right? My god. And it has a... Even though you're in like it's about bugs and you're in a, um, a nest, it almost has a, a Lovecraftian vibe. I don't know. Like... Like bugs meets Bloodborne. <laughs> I think I've got everything sorted here. So yeah, this is the Void Heart Edition. So as far as I know, it just means that it's got... Oh, this is a menu style. Hidden Dreams. I don't know what this is. The Grim Troop... Troop... Troop? Grim Troop? Like a circus thing? Lifeblood Godmaster. I don't know what any of that stuff's about. That's all DLC as far as I know. Um, but in like true fucking fashion to make this game the masterpiece that I have been you know been told that it is we'll see for ourselves um it's full of fantastic DLC huge DLC all right let us begin new game it's so gorgeous like once I seen that I don't know if you want to call it calligraphy or whatever this that art style that goes around the border basically I'm gonna put that in all my thumbnails it's gorgeous absolutely gorgeous all right hopefully we get some cutscenes I know these style games are not too many cutscenes. We shall see. Sounds good so far. In the wilds beyond, they speak your name with reverence and regret. For none can tame our savage souls, yet you they challenge met. Under palest watch you thought we changed, best base instincts we redeemed. A world you gave to bug and beast, and they had never dreamed. From Elegy for Hollow Nest by... Monomon the teacher. I I don't think that's based on actual something inside the game, I think. Nice. In the name of Jesus. God damn that rising music. That can't be good. Three bug heads or something like fucking alien. Yeah, so I I think um as far as I can tell, it's it's you know it's a it's a platformer as well. 
I think we I'm probably I probably myself throw around the word Metroidvania a little bit too much. They don't all mean that, you know. Here we are. We just arrive here. He's such a tiny little dude, but he's a little badass. Look at him. I love that hand drawn art style. Very like binding of Isaac. Off to the city we go. I don't think you're told very much. I didn't even read up about it. These kind of games you want to just dig in, jump in, literally like that, that dude. That dude he did it. And this is in game graphics. Very nice. Sometimes I'm playing a lot of games. Sometimes I wish I had a good or a, a PC rig at all, you know? Kind of sucks because I, I want to show these games off as good as I can. Like, I know 60 frames isn't everything. But I always feel like if the game is in 60 frames, I should be trying my best to do that. And uh, it just uh, kind of sucks in a way, you know. One day, you know. Oh, cool. We get to little see the credits. All right. We can jump. We can smack. Oh, cool. Break all the grass like Zelda. Nice. David Kazi. Beautiful so far. God, we're, I'm actually doing it. I'm so happy. Beat the crap out of this guy. So up the top, we got some kind of liquid. Let's hope it's booze and beer, and four little masks or five masks. I play a good bit of um these kind of 2D hack and slash, you know, Metroidvania style things. Like um, Thunder Lotus is a dev that I've been kind of following for a good bit. They made a Jotun, which was kind of like an isometric Norse god boss game. And then they made uh, Sundered, which uh, a little bit like this very Eldritch horror. Oh, fuck, that actually hit me. Okay. What's this? Interact. Creepy, I can hear voices. Hopefully I have it loud enough. I know this game, it has very um, ambient kind of stuff. Where uh, you can hear little voices and that in the background. Creepy. Higher beings, these words are for you alone. Your great is that us? He's talking to us. Your great strength marks you among us. Okay, focus your soul, and you shall receive feats in which others can only dream. Collect soul by striking enemies. Hold. Oh, I assume that's all. Let's try it now. Oh, that's that thing. Okay, I've seen people do that. It's obviously going to be pretty important. Oh damn! Everyone's messing me up now. Cool. Oh, the focus, yeah. Oh, cool, like the little thing is filling up like a shape. So, yeah, th I've seen people, like, create massive... Oh, man. Massive, like, lore videos and stuff. About Hollow Knight. Like, I'll tell you how deep it is. They, they don't make these stories up, you know? It's all there for the taking. This is beautiful. I'm not a big fan of bugs in general. Most of them are. Cool, can I... I don't want to break this. Oh. Sorry. Are they friendly? Who knows? Sorry. Give me some kind of blue thing. I'm sorry. I broke your shit. I can't break that one in the background for some reason. Give me two blue extra hearts or something. This is going to be full of secrets and stuff. Let's see what's down here. My curiosity. I must satiate it. I think that, that those little shells, like these things here, I think this is uh, our currency, our souls, I think. Oh, it takes a good bit of that. So is that like mana then? Is that like your... Yeah. And then when I tweeted out about doing this, uh, someone was nice enough to get back and say, say like, uh, they wanted to see how I get on. Then when I checked their channel, they had changed their channel into uh, like all Hollow Knight stuff, and that's amazing. Especially with Silk Song coming out. I don't know when it's state when it's supposed to come out. Could be next year. I think T Team Cherry is the name of the dev. Oh my freaking god. I think they might be Australian. I have to double check that. Hollow Knight, hey Andy, how are you doing, dude? I was just I was just talking about that. I this is my first time playing have you played? Have you played this? I think everybody fucking has besides me like like an idiot. Uh, let me see. Team Cherry. I hope you had a good weekend, dude. The heat here is, uh, yeah, South Australia from Adelaide. Cool. 
Uh, always nice to see um, devs from pl places you're not really used to. This is my first time playing this. And uh, this is one of these games that I've kind of kept. I bought, I bought it ages ago. I must have it about a year now. I just, I kind of kept it and it's always been in my PS4, like, the front page, you know? Where you can keep like 10 or 12 games ready to go. Oh, secrets. I was just waiting for that perfect moment. How the hell do you get over there? I must get a double jump later. And now that I'm kind of finished and put Neo to bed until Neo 2. Um, oh, you can actually break those? Oh. He's a cool little dude. He doesn't say much. Yeah, now it's time. I, and I'm playing uh, Bloodstained as well. Bloodstained is, is something that's... It's just really creepy and cool. Beyond this point, you enter the land of King and Creator. Step across this threshold and obey our laws. Bear witness to the last and only civilization, the Eternal Kingdom. Hollow Nest. Hollow Nest. Oh, I didn't press that again. I don't think I did. It's funny, like... Hollow Knight, Hollow Nest. Hollows usually mean like this. Oh, you can look down and up. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, there's no going over there. That's basically where we fell down anyway. It's clever. Beautiful, beautiful game. Looks like this place was sealed off. Should I even be doing this? Oh my god, I'm wailing on it. There we go. Shite. Should not have done that. Now I've opened up Hello nest. Please don't die. Oh, that's so cool. Welcome. Hello, stranger. What are you selling? What are you buying? <laughs> hey, Ghoulie Ghouls, how you doing? Weekend was good. Yeah, my weekend was really good. It was kind of busy as hell, and then I got to kind of relax. Um, I haven't streamed in a few days as well. There was a leak in... On the ceiling of my bathroom, so I had to rip the shit out of it. Dirt mouth. The feeding town. Very cool. So yeah, but I was kind of weirdly like therapeutic, getting the hook of a hammer and just reefing the fucking ceiling out of it. It's a pretty small little bathroom, it's an ensuite bathroom. But that was fun. So that's kind of what I did Saturday. I kept meaning to stream over the weekend because I had shit to do. And I just never got the chance. And then Sunday, we have like super warm weather here. Um, I went back out to my parents' house and I kind of, a little bit forced them, but urged them. We all went for like a, a family bike ride down the canals and stuff. It was real nice. And my father hasn't been too well. He's not long out of hospital. And I know it's probably a bit stupid of me, but I'm kind of like trying to get him out exercising. Because I still, like he could be fitter. He could be better. He's doing good though. I didn't want to push him too far, you know. Uh, but yeah, so that was really nice, really warm, kind of one of those moments you go too far and you're like, oh Jesus Christ, what was I thinking, you know? Did I go too far? It's, it's one of those kind of direct heats, weird heat waves, but I'm glad you just had a good weekend. How, how was your weekend, Goody? And Dynamite, how you doing, dude? Super duper noodles. Keeper hit deeper, that's me. But then so fun to watch. Yeah, I hope you do as well, like, hopefully it'll go down sale soon. I know it's, um... The sales are doing well, that's usually a good sign. And it's totally worth it. Like, if you love Castlevania at all, it's just a beautiful love letter. Like, the more I play, the more I see little nods to Symphony of the Night. It's so good. Like, I finished it um, the other day, and it's only I'm only half done, you know? It was like the fake bad ending. As soon as I killed the boss, it went game over, like I died. <laughs> I was like, God damn you, dude. Fucking Koji Igarashi, the guy who made the old Castlevanias, they love doing that kind of stuff. Yeah, that was a gutsy jump, yeah. So this this is a little bit of a different style game. Hollow Knight, the, the sequel for it, Hollow Knight Silk Song, where you play as a, a, her name is Hornet, she's like a little girl, she's a little badass girl. You fight her in this, but they give her her own game, and it's coming to Switch. Um, and I'm hoping to get a Switch for the years so, though, because I have so many games, I want to play Link's Awakening, I want to play Pokemon, they're saying it's easy, but I don't care, I miss Pokemon. I want to play... Yoshi's crafted world is too damn cute and I used to love Yoshi's story like <laughs> So yeah Hollow Knight is one on the list I've been saving for a special occasion and I can devote my attention to it you know same with Bloodstained 
But I thank thank you so much for coming in, guys. I I appreciate the shit out of you. I was playing a little bit of Wolfenstein uh, there a minute ago, and now I kind of relax with this. I love the Switch. Yeah, I've been dying to get one, and that Switch Lite can kiss my ass. They, for some goddamn reason, God bless the currency converter. Like, someone just, their their calculator's like, I don't fucking know, you know? The, the, their calculator's always coming up boobs. No matter what they, what they fucking uh, put into it, it's always boobs. 80085 boobs. But yeah, it's like extra 50 bucks, so they want 250 euro for... The switch light, which is bollocks. I mean, you're not saving any money and you're losing everything. So, I mean, if he's, you know, if if he's want the switch light, it's fine. I'm not telling people what to buy. I just think it, it, they strip like 80% of of the point of the switch. You know, so the Joy Cons are gone. There's no TV output, so I, you couldn't even use an Elgato with it. Um, yeah, the Joy Cons. There's no two player. You can't go into TV mode at all in any sense. It's just a pure handheld. It should have been 150 bucks. If it's going to replace the 3DS, that's the price they should have went for. But so good. So good. What I'll end up doing is I'll wait and I'll get a, a Switch, Pikachu, or whatever the fuck it is. I don't know. One of those. Keep in mind, Pokemon Let's Go games. You can't use the Pro Controller for real? Damn. That's fucked up. There's a little Pokemon controller, isn't there? As bad an idea as the 2DS. Well, at least the 2DS was appropriate. Like, over here, you could get the 2DS with a game for, like, 99 euro. And that's... At least that's good pricing, I suppose. You guys don't get too bad a deal in the UK and that. Um, but here, we get screwed. They don't know how to add things up at all. It's kind of sad, this. Alright, so this is the only guy left in this little village. Oh, there, Traveler. He's the Elder Bug. I'm afraid there's only me left to offer welcome. It's like a bug's life, except... Lovecraftian. The other residents, they've all but disappeared. Headed down that well one by one into the caverns below. So I think in this one, you have to go down into Hollow's Nest. And then in Silk Song, she's down below and she has to come back up or something. There's crazy ass bosses in this. It's long felt to ruin, yet it still draws folks into its depths. Wealth, glory, enlightenment. That darkness seems to promise all things. I'm sure you two seek your dreams down there. But watch out. It's a sickly air that fills this place. Creatures turn mad and travelers are robbed of their memories. Perhaps dreams aren't such great things after all. This is a dream. Listen. Alright, so he sits on these little cute little benches to rest. Look at this dude. Little Hollow Knight. Is that all it does? We just chill? I think that's the, the signifier of the, the bonfires of a Souls game. You got nothing to say, buddy? Well, you just talk a little bit. I love the, like, the border of all the words and of all the conversations and that. It's so, it's, it's like, looks like a little bug. Whatever they call it. Is it calligraphy or something? Many used to come, hoping the kingdom would fill their desires. Hollow Nest, it was once called. Supposing the greatest kingdom there ever was, full of treasures and secrets. Alright. Everything fades eventually. The bench may be iron. I know well to talk to the NPCs until they start repeating themselves. No better place to collect your thoughts before heading below. There's a whole lot of different stuff you can get. With games like, you know, Bloodstained, Hollow, or, uh, yeah, Hollow Knight, and, what's that one? The Messenger. Uh, there's so many great fucking games. It's like, through all the AAA nonsense that's going on with microtransactions, all that shit, loot boxes. I, retro games still live on, you know? Retro style games, anyway. Okay. Cool. You got anything else? Can I go in here? This poor little town. What's this? For all your mapping supplies, we will be opening soon. Isilda and Cornifer. Corn Cornifer. Oh, does he start to run if you just push that way enough? I just do. My little hollow knight. Oh fuck, I just jumped down the well. <laughs> I was a well, I thought I was in elevator. Oh well. Oh, forgotten crossroads. Well, we're about to forget how we fell down here. Have you played this before? No, no, I didn't. You could have sworn I did. No, I play. I do play a lot of these 2D impossible style games, right? I played Slain. Slain is fucking back from hell. That game's awesome if you get it cheap. 
Uh, I played Sundered, which is a beautiful, like, hand drawn. Uh, um, it's like a. I suppose it's Lovecraftian as well. I'm gonna break everything! But I have, this one I have not, Ghost. No, no, no. How was your weekend, Ghost? Did you get up to any, anything good? Is everything okay? You said there was a hurricane heading your way. Is everything alright? Your power didn't go around, did it? Yeah, I, I, it definitely is right up my alley. It's one I've like kept, girls. I've, I've kept it like a little prized possession that was on the front of my PS4 for so long, calling out to me. I never. I wanted to wait till I had that moment, not just not to do two streams on it and then never touch it. No, no, no. Yeah, it's been a crazy little weekend, but it's all good. It was, it was necessary, you know. I was worn out and uh, allow me to kind of recharge and reset me batteries and I kind of feel normal again I was kind of between the weather like just it almost takes your fucking mental capacity away from you you can't think you can't do anything you can't even eat properly everything was gone um yeah just it, it, I feel like I'm, I'm myself again I was kind of lost there for a second just everything else going on, running the race and dropping people off, going into the hospital and all this kind of shit. Oh bollocks. So yeah, I do I, I know very little about this. But I know that uh there's people that have whole channels around this game. Lower videos the size of Dark Souls lore. That's impressive. So these little shells that are dropping I think are called Geodes or Geo Geodudes. And they're like the currency. Is this dead? I did I do this? I'm sorry. It's a bug's life, and a bug's life is hard. Remember that bug's life game on the PS1? Fucking grasshoppers used to fuck me up. Fuck me up, grasshoppers. Good to see you back. Yeah, thank you. It, was only, it wasn't that long, but yeah, you, I, as soon as like even two or three days not streaming, you um, you feel like you're a new ball over again, you know? Everything you start to set up things the way you like it, and you're like, geez, this. It's all fucking feels new again. I suppose it's a good thing too, though. The Pilgrim's Way. Okay. Verdant wilds and fungal groves to the city of the kingdom's heart. There, all wishes shall be granted. All truths revealed. So you can kind of repair your health by charging up the little dude. It's kind of cute. Oh my god. Oh my god. How are you doing? Looks like we have our first little mini boss. Damn. Dink! I like that little ding. I like that little ding ding you got going on. Come on. I know you're blocking that area. I won't give up. <laughs> I watch the let's play. I usually watch your let's plays and a couple of. Oh, oh I got hurt. No, oh, thank you, Goose. Yeah, I do. Uh, I see every now and then you comment on um, my stuff over on YouTube, even though it's like a stream you might have already been in. <laughs> I was like, you crazy, you crazy. But I appreciate that. I think even when you were kind of coming back to doing your own stuff, you you kind of went around and you know got back into things, which is really cool of you. I don't know if water is poisonous in this one. This is gonna be a pretty chill game until like a boss happens, probably. Yeah, it's one I, one I wish I definitely played. I think it's it's only about a year too old though. And this supported the hell out of this. Like this version I got, I got this for like seven bucks or something. It comes with all the DLC. Of course, then they put it on the Xbox Game Pass. It's a strange kind of time we live in with that Xbox Game Pass, because I'm like, it's so much good value, it's, it's like, like the Netflix the game and where it uh, might destroy everything else, you know? Oh well. Alright, I'm just going to keep going down. There is a map, right? Can you hear that? I'm not humming, someone else is humming. Duty me though. Yeah, I just love I love the little right in the border and everything. I'm gonna put that all over the thumbnails. Focus old nail. Looks like a jousting spike. I go I've been going on like um I love going on uh game and rabbit holes, you know. You find like one video and you're like, oh and then it'd be like four in the morning and you're for some goddamn reason watching a video on 
the complete history of this developer, this developer, but it's cool. Like, with most most games, there's controversial shit. Uh, usually the story behind how the game is made turns out to be better than how the game actually is. Who are you, sir? You're humming away? Come down to explore these beautiful old rooms. Don't mind me! I have a fondness for exploring myself. Getting lost and finding your way is a pleasure like no other. Jesus! Well, look, you gotta get your rocks off somehow. We're exquisite to be looking at you when I'm... I'm a cartographer by trade. Nice! And I'm working on mapping this area right now. Cool. Cartographer will always make me think of Halo. Would you like to buy a copy of my work so far? Oh, yeah, it's only 30. Yeah, go ahead. Nice. Hold L1. Oh, that's why I couldn't find it. Chocolate. Cheers, big ears. Map can be useful thing, but alone won't show you where you are. If you're not... If you've not the head for directions, I expect... Okay. All right, look. Fine, fine, okay. How much are you going to charge me every time, you bollocks? I see your scam. She'll even sell some of my old maps from time to time. All right, cool. Can't wait till the Ori, Ori 2 comes out. <laughs> Interesting. Where am I on this map? The fuck are those ships? I don't see myself. Is that, no, that's where the cartographer is. Maybe that's where I am. Interesting. Yeah, we still have full week of rain, but it's spinning out, rain and power in now. Oh, that sucks. Our main concern is flooding. Of course, of course, of course. That time you posted that picture and that was just a normal, like, day like, without even having a storm. That was insane. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know the. Is this important, this humming? Sometimes I don't get in to hang on all the streams. Yeah, so I put on a VOD while I'm chilling. Oh, that's cool. Because I actually get, like,. Unusual amount of views on my VODs over here. Like, I'll get into, like, the double digits, and I'm like, what? You get, you'll get, you usually get a few after a stream if you raid or whatever, because Twitch being Twitch, it's like, oh, are they still watching? Um, but yeah. So now I know it's probably little Google sometimes. Well, I appreciate that. You, I don't know where you find the time. I really don't. I don't know how you do it. Everything you do... I know how you do it. I appreciate the hell out of you. And I had so much fun in your stream. I don't want to bring it up, but... Yeah, I can't wait for the next one. It's good to have everybody kind of back, right? It's great to have Dub back as well. If I can, and Vex is over here now as well. She's streaming a little bit. It's fucking awesome. It is awesome. If A little bit of, uh, a little bit of the old summer. And, uh, and in your Discord, I think I've seen Show as well. Show come in and say hello. I got a, I got a message that guy. What the hell are these things? You look nice. Yeah. I'd say you'd love Bloodstained as well, girls. It's a little bit expensive right now. I think it's like 30. No, it's like fucking 40 bucks. I got, I love it, but. Mm. But I know you're a, you're a, you're an old school fan. You enjoy your Castlevania. I don't know how you're supposed to get up there. Later when I get double jump and triple jump and your mom's jump. And where's my jumper? Where's my jumper? Where's my jumper? I know, man. This is not the weather for jumpers. You still catch me in my leather jacket. Hey, Look, it's the fawns. And he's sweating. I got into... Went down, like, several rabbit holes. I was watching lower videos for this. I was watching... Um, I love to watch the history of uh, Square Enix and all that. And how, like, some of the classic, classic JRPGs how much they changed everything and influenced each other and so much like bad shit happened in the background like how Final Fantasy bred Final Fantasy Adventure which turned into Secret of Mana and then Secret of Mana was only half made and then our Secret of Mana came to Chrono Trigger and it's just like I love it just blow your fucking mind all over the floor and then you pick it up and blow it all over again I blew my own mind that's messed up Oh, look at this. You motherfucker. Oh, no! Oh, my God. Did I die? No, I think I'm good. That was a dirty dig, said I, said I to Brady. To Brady. I'm hooked on house flipper. Yes! I'm so glad you got that. I'm really sure I was asking you to get that a while back. That is, that, that is right up your alley. And there's garden flipper as well. It's one of those games, like, kind of sort of like Sims where you spend all this time... Making stuff and doing stuff and uh, they're like, this is not going anywhere. Is this a waste of my time? I don't care. I'm having fun. 
Aye. That dirty little brat. Hello, are you friendly? Big hugs. It's like um a baby caterpillar. You're free. Then I was watching like old Robin Williams movies, and that led me to watch some Mork and Mindy, and then some Happy Days, and I just went on a big. And then like my brain just forgets that he's gone. I'm like, fuck this world. And then I'm like depressed for an hour. <laughs> I'm, like pissed off for an hour. I say depressed, but that fucking word is thrown around too much. God damn kids. God damn. Yeah. I'll be playing something once it gets less rainy. Yeah, totally, totally, totally. So I come down here for that little grub. Better have been worth it. Probably shouldn't have jumped down the well so fast. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do, huh? Capiche, capoodle. Yeah, house flipper. I know, it's just crazy. There's so many games of that where you're like, what am I doing? It's like uh, all these crazy simulators as well, and you're like, this is so stupid. And you're like, I secretly want to play the shit out of this. Yeah. <laughs> Toaster simulator. Fuck. It's even better than Iron Bread. Iron Bread. Iron Bread. I've never been so raged out by a piece of bread in all my fucking life. I've seen some shit. Said the pumpernickel to the rye. <laughs> I've seen some shit. Oh, I love secrets. These guys, you know what these remind me of? Whatever these little geodes or whatever. They remind me of the clams from the Flintstones. Remember when it's like, that'll be 20 clams. Watch now, I'll, I'll try not to pick one up so you can get a good look at the little uh, 3D model thing. See, it's spinning down there. It's probably a little shell or something. Or like, if it's a geode, it's not like a fossilized, fossilized stone or something. Looks like a clam. They're supposed to be doing a new Flintstones cartoon, like, fuck, yeah. Leave things alone, please. Leave me with my memories. What's left of them? It looks like you get more of this mana. Uh, I'm locked in here now, boys. Time for a little mini room. Come here, you orange bastard. Oh, you fucking bastard. Sorry, I won't call you orange bastard. Amber bastard. That's what I'll call you. What else is in here? Another one? Two more! Bring it! So have you guys been watching the, the tennis at all? Or do you care about that kind of stuff? The whole, like, obsession with the royal family, if you want to call them that. It's so stupid, like she was saying, uh, Oh, I don't, want, don't, I don't want to be filmed at Wimbledon and all this kind of shit. I'm like, oh, I'm like what? You want to be filmed with balls in your face or something? <laughs> like, what are you doing? That kind of shit annoys the hell out of me. I'm like, I'm here for tennis! I don't give a shit what any person is wearing! Yeah, but look what she's wearing, man. I don't care. It always seems like the, the bottom three are like always... I, I prefer uh, women's tennis. Uh, I see a lot of uh, women's sports kind of finally getting the uh, the recognition it deserves. But I, I always feel like it's a little bit pandering as well. It's like, oh, we can, we can get the... You know, all these news and all these fucking articles and stuff. It's like they're trying to secure a women's vote that doesn't exist or some shit. But yeah, like the the US team and the soccer and stuff. Very cool. Yeah, the women's tennis. Venus Williams. Oh, it's Serena Williams even. Poor she's getting a bit old, I think. She's not long after having a kid as well. It's crazy that she's able to devote that kind of time and stuff. Camera does move around a little bit. So it might be a bit jarring. Sorry about that. Gotta order my dinner. Okay, no worries, ghouls. I hope you pick an awesome dinner. Welcome back, pal. Sorry if I'm missing a bit. Yeah, talk to Shaw. Okay. Cool. I'm missing a good bit. Sorry, you get better. Can I go in here? Is this okay? Don't kill. This is like hot springs. Oh, it's actually healing me. Sweet. It's me, that one guy. That one guy we all know. I know him. I don't watch tennis. I used to play, but it's terrible boring to watch. Yeah, not as bad as golf, though. Or cricket. I can get behind tennis. The rest of it, I'm like, I can take or leave. Come on up here. I'm going to try and 
break in here. Come here. Come here. So I think I can jump on you, can't I? Oh, you shit. Big booty on you. Who knows if I'm going the right way? USA football team is ruining the game. That's the point in the watching the World Cup when they're they're four on four. Is that what it is? It's just for the women's. It's only four on four. I think he was going to charge at me there, little shite. I love this hand drawn style. It's so cool. It's like the bugs you would have drawn in your notepad as a kid. You know, it's like I made this bug. Can't kill them anymore. Anyway. Oh, mosquito. How are you supposed to get them to fall everywhere? That sucks. I wish they would magnetize to you. He's a little he's a strong little dude. Hollow Knight. I like that name as well. It's like a, a ghost or something. Come on, you little shits. I'm a rocking man. Scoops. Cups are as, oh, as teams, four on four teams. Must be unpredictable. It makes them fun to watch. Yeah. Well, I love the way it goes like silent when you get hit. You feel very punished. Like he's going deaf for a second or something. It's four women's World Cup and America's one off. Yeah. How did you even get up there? It's a nice bit of light coming off him as well. Yeah, I don't know. You wonder how they make games like this with that hand-drawn art style. I don't understand drawing them, but actually making them work like this. I was going to try something there, but I didn't want to overdo it. What other teams are in it? It's just nice to see them be covered by uh, Oh, I didn't even know. Covered by any fucking website or TV. Oh, what's up there? I don't know if I'm going that way. It seems to be the only way. We're going looking for the first boss. So they said this is the map. I'm not even on the fucking map. Oh! Big map. Zoom out. Even more? Oh my god. There's more over here. Oh my god. Dirt mouth and forgotten crossroads. Yeah, we know we're there. I just don't see myself on the map. I think that's the joke, right? What does this mean? Go this way. It'll take me out of the well? No, I know I'm somewhere else. No, it's not called a crossroads for nothing. It probably has four ways of going. What the hell is this? A shop? I keep breaking everyone's signs and I'm wondering what where I am. Stinky Mo Minky. Ooh, this is nice. Probably best idea to rest where I can. What? A toll machine with the symbol of a stag. Cert Geo. Geo! A toll. It's like a toll bridge. Can I kill him? I don't want to pay that, do I? Let's give it a shot. We're here, aren't we? Yes. Ching, ching, ching. Ching, ching, ching. All right. What's this do? Bye. Oh, but whoa! Holy crap! The toll is for it's like a a train or something. Stag beetle train thing. Oh. Greetings, little one. The last stag. Cool. All aboard the stag express or something like that. It's been an age since I last heard the ringing of a station bell. It echoed down the stagways and called me to you. I've grown stiff and tired over these many years and I've forgotten much. The sound of the bell will always call me back. These stagways stretch the depths of Hollow Nest. If you want to travel them, hail me from the platform. I will take you where you need to go. Whoa! Okay then. Okay. There's only, I've only two places I can go though. Dirt mouth. Alright. Is it going to cost me money every time? Hell no! Oh, that's so cool, we get treated to a little load screen slash cutscene. Nice. Seems like there's room for someone else on there. I don't think this game is co-op or anything. Sweet. No! Oh, jeez, I always miss the lads. I always miss it. Who are you? What's this? A notice board. 
Aw, can I get out here? What the hell am I doing here then? Oh, that'll do that. Ah, oh, that does open the door. Cool! This leading me to a door that wasn't open before. Shortcuts for the wind, boys. Hello! You're the same one, aren't you? Never thought I'd see such a thing. The stag station has opened. The building lay silent since before even my time. I've heard the tales of the glorious lines. A web of tunnels running all the way through the kingdom. Not that I'll ever be travelling them, mind you. I'm quite content where I am. I don't know if you say so. Boy! Young oh, couples just recently yeah. taken up residence in the house beside the station. Seems they're running a map shop, which may excite adventurous types like yourself. She's a tall bug, the wife. I told him to take a larger house, especially given they're all empty. But he liked the look of that one. The way she has been just to get through the door, I wouldn't put it up. To... Mm. Our cartographer seems to have a wife. It must be this person with the glasses on the front. Let's go talk to his wife. See where that's going. Mm, it's like the SPFL. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's annoying. That was the same like Man United. Even I support Man United, and then eventually you just get sick of the wind and everything. <sighs> Papa Nada. Papa, oh, that's a Zelda. Nice. She's like a, a really uh, slim, tall aunt. Come to buy a map, have you? It's really my husband you should be dealing with, but what a surprise! He's headed down below. Oh, he pop pack up occasionally to deliver new maps. All right. Now let's see what you've got to sell. Notch. I recommend it. If you're having trouble finding your way in the maze of rooms below us, try this charm. You will pinpoint your location. Ah, crap, I need that. I don't have enough. I'm off by, like, 22. You need this if you want to update your map with new areas as you explore. Jeez, you really have to map your own stuff. These pins will mark benches. Oh, cool. Cocoon. Have you seen those beautiful blue cocoons? Hmm. Vendor. Stagway. Hot springs, that must be what we were in earlier. Take me sometimes, I'm sure you'd be better used to these pins till then. This is cool. Scarab. Interesting spots. Okay, cool. And a shell. Hard one battles. Nice. But that first one we really need. She said I could sell stuff, but I just don't think I have anything. Ah oh, well. I'll be right back. Way I shouldn't have got that. So, does that mean more and more people will move in? Oh, this looks like a graveyard. Cool, I think it is. Smack everyone. What is this? Inspect. Stone door with a simple lock. That is it. Back, welcome back. What did you pick? One taco salad. Mmm, Jesus Christ. So, like, which is your favorite, do you think? You like a good soft shell taco, or are you, or do you prefer a taco salad? There's more eating in a taco salad, I suppose. Damn, making me hungry now. Hungry. Yeah, busy, busy old weekend. Boop. It's good. It's good to kind of like the summer. You always kind of like fuck up your sleeping pattern. I don't care what age you are. It's nice to kind of get it back. These guys like to charge. Charge it! You only gave me two? You miserable guess. I kind of feel bad. Some of these bugs are kind of cute. Kind of cute. It's getting kind of cute. Yeah, it goes the, the, um... That little channel you put on your Discord. The movie... The movie night, the movie idea. Whatever you want to call it. That's a great idea. Very good. Very good. I see, like, so many Discords and... Everyone kind of takes a piece from here and there and definitely a lot of people got a lot of ideas from yours as well once you get the the uh, the principles down right music always I wanted a salad yeah sounds good though man I eat like um, pasta salads all the time uh, for dinner there's enough eating in it you know it's the carbs or whatever but depends on my mood yeah yeah well we are this is cool. I found the cartographer's wife. She'll sell me some stuff I can... Oh, you dirty bastard. You can mark the map. It's kind of chill. Oh, did you hear that noise? <laughs> it sounded like the fart putty noise. Like... <laughs> That's awesome. I'm such a kid. I can't help it. On my way. Let's pick up the pieces. Some nasty, nasty wet noises. <laughs> that was the moist noise. 
can I go from here? Have I been in here? I, think I have. This guy is blocking this area. Eh? Any bollocks? Damn it! You swear you got him when he gets. He took two hours? Some of my bitch. Oi! I love the hand drawn art style though, it's so cute. Honest to god, I would draw little weird little bugs and men and monsters on my notepad. They all look so stupid though. As a kid, you know? I ain't got no art style. Salt inside of a tortilla bowl. Mmm. Classic fixings. Oh, damn. Your mouth's water and thinking about it. And I bet yours is too. Hell yeah. Now, you guys know how to do food down south. Like, everything you've ever told me about the food, I'm like, Jesus Christ. I don't, I'm not like a big kind of seafood kind of guy. Like, I just haven't tried much, you know? The bare, the bare minimum, whatever Irish catch kind of stuff, you know? When you talk about crawfish and stuff, I'm like, good lord. Good lord! Good love! How do you get up there? I'm gonna save you, little grub bastard! I'm gonna get you! Hold on, Jimmy! Sweet Jesus, Jimmy! Hold on! Have you got an air hole? Sweet Jesus, Jimmy! These bastards don't lock Jimmy up! Where are you? Follow me, Mr. Mosquito. First I mosquito and then I sheet. How do you do that again? Alright. No, Jimmy! I've only got one life left. Don't fuck with me now, mosquito. I need your help. I'm gonna bounce on you like a little old trampoline. Now he's stuck. God bless him. It's a bit hard of hearing, but we still... Oh, not enough. I was on the right path, though, right? See? I'm using the old noodle. They're gonna cut open my head and they're gonna have noodles inside. It's like that bit in uh, Annihilation where he cuts your man's stomach up and he's got all these, like, fucking eels and, and tentacles in his stomach. Really cool. Chase, little ghost bro, how you doing? Do you ever play this? This feels like a chase game. All the classic ta taco toppings, accessories like sour cream. Oh, Pyro giving you shit, is he? Giving you a little doggy bag. Mm, cultured. Yeah, see, we don't know anything about that. Cyber, do you have those delivery wankers? What's delivery wankers? Like delivery wankers? What were you talking about earlier, ghost? Fucking bee simulator? I missed that. You were gone. I didn't want to mention it when you were gone. That's what I do. People go like, be right back. And I'm like talking away to them. Like, bitch, I said be right back. <laughs> oh, JJ, what is up, dude? Slides in on some orange glades. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Mm, I want prawns. Yeah. I was suppose you... I don't know if you'd even call like lobster, crawfish, and prawns like seafood. I think when people think seafood, they're like more like fucking... Fucking sushi and raw fish and stuff. Nope, I haven't decided I won't have to play too many games. I know, I know, me too. You want cultured swine? Yeah, you're saying you talk to show, that's awesome. I must hit him up. Yeah, pre the pre simulator? For real? A B simulator? I think I've seen that. Are you were you just messing? Is there a pre simulator? Ain't nobody want no damn pre simulator? Fucking Magdalene Sister Simulator, where the nuns used to beat the shit out of women over here. Good times. They should watch uh, Butcher Boy. Great Irish movie. Some great. Actually, uh, there's some good Irish movies. Gotta say. I gotta say. It's lovely day. Even some corny uh, Irish horror movies, horror comedies. I like them. It's one called Grabbies that I always bring up. And in the movie, they have to get pissed drunk to um, to stay safe, basically. It's really good. It's not as good as like something like Shaun the Dead or whatever. But actually, that's what I liked about season three of Stranger Things. Kind of borrowed a little bit from Day of the Dead. It borrows a bit from everything. It's a clever fucking show. They're geniuses preying on our nostalgia. Wee. Prawns are giants. No, I think they're small ones. Shrimp are like fucking huge. Same with mussels. Yeah, mussels. No, no. Oysters and mussels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, DJ, how are you doing, dude? How was your How was your weekend? Have you played this? I bet you have. I. I Hello. Oh, is this what the grubs are all about? Hello. I did save one. Wait. Oh. 
Thank you. Is, am I saving your babies? You got a lot of fucking babies. I gotta save all these. If there's more than a handful, it's not worth doing. How you doing? Who does the voice acting for this? I need to know. Was it you, Ghoulie? I found a priest channel? I kind of feel bad that I subbed to him because he's ridiculously attractive. Oh my god, what am I gonna do with this girl? And her crazy, crazy, um... <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I'm not listening to anything he's saying. At least I'm self-aware. She just put it on mute? The mute, the mute priest? Good lord. Do you ever like, do you ever get so self-aware you're like, why, why have I got weird, weird crushes on these crazy people? It's actually, com priest similar is actually common, there you go. Deliveroo is a company that you phone to collect your food for you. Yeah, I think uh, it's like Just Eat or something we have. Just Eat. Yeah, pretty much everyone would, everyone would do that. I think in America you guys got like Postmates. They'll just deliver everything. So weird, I don't trust people. You guys trust people too much. The idea is to get the food into your hand without, and into your mouth, without it passing as, as little hands as possible. Because you know every time your food passes onto another person's hands, there's a chance that they're going to put like some nasty shit on it. Without getting too much into detail, because that's gross. Um, it's one thing I don't fuck with. It's my cardinal rule, is I don't fuck with food. Don't fuck with another man's food. You can fuck with anything else, I don't give a shit. Play any of your practical jokes all you want. You do not fuck with my food. That's a big no-no. If someone fucks with my food, that is it. Mortal fucking enemies. Don't give a shit what else you do. You can put, do the old sleep and war hand in the warm water. Shaving cream, I don't care what you do. Don't fuck with another man's food. Get yourself killed in Ireland. Cleaning in this hot as ass weather, yeah, yeah, Jesus. You know, I haven't played it. Yeah, it's so fucking hot. At least you guys are kind of used to or expecting it. This is fucking madness. Here. Can I? I can actually go back up. Nice. You sub to me for the same reason, right, guys? Oh shit! Here we go. Ah, oh, here we go again. Oh shit. I'm just some knob on a motorbike. <laughs> stocky, stocky. Yeah, but there was a time when that would be somebody's first job, you know, piece of delivery dude or whatever, or their last job. I want to play the old school. Blue, Blues Butters game, god damn it. <sighs> Buff and Buff and out of yourself, bitch. Mm -hmm. I don't need to hear that shit right now. Alright, so this lets me pinpoint where I am on the map or something. Equip a charm to activate its powerful abilities. Equip a charm, open the charms menu while resting at a bench. You're gonna say the word charmed a lot. Start playing the team music to the team show of the team show. For some reason, there's like retweets and stuff popping up on Twitter. I keep seeing. Fucking craft, the craft everywhere. I need to watch the craft to get it out of my system. Well, calling someone a knob. <laughs> oh god, you knob. I suppose it's. I like. I like um, insults that are kind of sound funny, better than just the average like. It's better than just the average swear, right? Right. How do I go? How do I do this? Map. Ooh, I like that music. What's this say about quill? Without a quill, it cannot be up. Oh. Go fuck yourself. Yeah, right. Do I have to pinpoint? I still don't know how to map. The map is a bit of a contrary bitch in this, I think. It's nothing we can't get used to. It sound like something I'd say. Not sure what slang is British or not. Yeah, I don't know. Like this... Like, like, look at like jaywalking or whatever, right? That word jaywalking, which is kind of mainly, mainly used in America. Well, I think the actual saying, calling someone a jay, is 
It's like, uh, it's like a slang for an idiot or something. These things start all over, you know. So the Irish can't even be trusted to be actually Irish anymore because we've spread to the four corners of the world. Like a fucking virus! The, the spuds try to wipe us out. So we ran to the corners of the world in search of spuds that wouldn't kill us. And there we found many horrors. Yeah, like knobhead and stuff. You knobhead! Chod, chod, juggler, chod, chod. We don't use that one too often. Taint goblin. Oh shit! Look how fucking big this area is. Fuck me. Every one of these is a door. Oh Jesus! Taint. It's in the taint. That that word has really come back. I like just asshole. Asshole. Remember when you were a kid, you'd, you'd try and make up all these fake curse words so you wouldn't get in trouble? You'd be saying like grasshole instead of asshole. Boop. Chode. Chode station? Ch I thought that said chode stallion for a second. I haven't introduced myself, have I? Yes, I should apologize for that. When you spend a lot of time by yourself with your own thoughts, you forget the niceties of conversation. Here, fucking here. And sometimes that's a good thing. My name is Cornifer. Oh, yeah. I've always loved exploring the world. Why, when I was first hatched, I wandered off immediately, leaving my brothers and sisters and poor mother behind. He was found in the next door neighbor's house in the candy drawer. That's why as soon as I moved to Dirtmouth with my... I like that. It's like Dartmouth. It's not like a, a school over there or something. A huge unending kingdom to explore right at our doorstep. Anyways, I'll let you return to our travels. With a little luck, we'll meet again. Yes, mm -hmm. we will. Chocolate. You find on my map. I've tried to fill out as much as possible. Every map is a work in progress. Alright. Set up a little store to help. Okay. So am I showing up on the map now? Noise. Noise and toy. That's noise and toy. <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> Uh, they taught us to get creative. Yeah, when I was a kid, we got all the bad insults from Beavis and Butthead. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> There's one for the movie list, girls. Beavis and Butthead do America. You splinkity splop. That didn't make no sense. You can do better than that, goddammit. Sniff my trundle wheel. Jesus. That's a bit better. Goody's already got that one down, though. Suck my mufflers. Is that from a diary of a wimpy kid? I have no idea. I've never watched the, or seen any of that stuff. I promise you. What's the other one? Henry. Horrid Henry. Oh, I'm Henry the Eighth. I am. Henry the Eighth. I am. I am. Second verse. Same as the first. I like that it creates a little face up the top. Alright, I need to get a boss. Come on, lads. Come on now. So, um... An Irish uh, comedian. He's pretty, pretty funny. We liked him in our family. He uh, passed away recently. It kind of sucks. I, think, I feel like as the years go on, I know that's just fucking time and age and all that. But everybody's fucking dying, man. Just, just slow the fuck down, everybody. Everybody dying. Why you fuck you dying? <laughs> That's not even funny. Do you like Diary of Wimper Kid? Speaking of kids, how is, uh, you must be, uh, how is, how is, uh, the teacher's, I think it's the teacher's aid, right? How is it going, goes? You, you're at, like, is it more than a month now? I'd say maybe it's a month in a week, five weeks. How are things? Did you try the wax on, wax off approach like I said? I know you can't like make them paint the fence because you needed a lot of fence in the school, but you get the gist. I know my tips are not helping, but you secretly appreciate them. It's okay. <laughs> uh, I think. 
wimpy. Never insult anyone anyway. So I don't even think of any good insults. Damn. What about like gentlemanly insults? You, sir, smell like the arse of Cornwallis. I actually really enjoyed that movie. Which one? Which? The cool whip one? Did I even wimpy kid? Oh no, what is this all about? They roll up on you really quick. They give you little hugs. Oh, we're great. Hell yes. Yeah, that's probably why I haven't asked you in a while. I don't keep asking you, but... Yeah. It's always cool. It's one of those things, like... You've you've really managed to do a lot in a short amount of time, goes. And it uh, kind of, like... It's probably the same as you. You kind of wake up and you're like, Oh yeah, shit, look at me. I got some of my life together. <laughs> I'm adulting. Look at me. I'm adulting. Adulting. That sounds wrong when you say it like that. Me and Ricky Lake are adulting, you know what I'm saying? No, oh, no, no, no. Can I do this? No, that hurts my insides. Well, you can, kind of. You can kind of attack down and hop off them. That's going to come in handy later. I do shit all the time. Is, is why won't be a spin-off wimpy kid? Exactly. It sounds like the wino, right? When you're a little bit wino-y. Scott, Scott Bayo-y. Wino-y. Does that actually take me up? I don't even double jump. I have no... I don't know where I'm going right now. I mean that in game and in real life. I know. I get lost on the way to the fridge, man. I have a little mini existential crisis on the way to the fridge. God damn, what was I doing in this room? No one will ever know. I hate myself. Anyway, I'm going to drop out here. Oh, I didn't even know you are still here. Cheers, dynamite. Have a good night, dude. How was the rest of uh, Lord of the Rings and the Hobbits? Did you watch them? Just imagine Google being your teacher. I do. I'm not. No, I'm not allowed to imagine that. Sorry, I'm not allowed. I'm not allowed to imagine that. I'd say she'd be fucking awesome. She would have straightened you out, Pyro. She was your teacher. Look at this motherfucker. How you doing, sir? Is he? He's not friendly. Take me to the river, bitch, bitch, bitch. Get fucking wrecked! You big old dragon tooth! Damn! Stomp the iron tree starring fucking Biggie Smalls. Also known, he's called Boogie Smalls. You see what I did there? Oh, you fucking bitch! You gonna trap me in there? Hell to the no, no, no. We ain't going down like this! Come on, people! Damn! I can't- oh, fuck me. He does two damage? Yes! Put the fear of Jesus Christ himself. Jesus Christ Superstar. In them new Nike ears. Unplugged, how the hell are you doing, dude? Playing a little bit of Hollow Knight, sorry. Got a bit wrapped up. I've never played this before, so it's kind of- It's blowing me away. Diary of Wimper Kid was a really awesome movie. You- Oh, you watched it with my nephews. Oh, yeah, that old card. Goody, the only one in the cinema. Eat milk dozen. And popcorn spills a little milk duds in. Eats a little bit more. Spill a little milk duds in. I love this movie. You've watched all the books. Read all the books. Watched, you've listened to the audio books. You've got a Diary of Wimpy Kid t-shirt. Don't you lie. Don't you lie. Why the fuck you lying? I'm going to just walk up. And you get like free into the movies. Because you used to work there. She's like, there's nothing else on. I'm going to watch Diary of Wimpy Kid. If you hold that and don't hold it the whole way... Nothing works. It's kind of like when you hold in. Tell you not to hold in your pee. Like, don't. It's bad for you. Don't hold it in. I'm like, don't tell me what to do. Two weeks later, I had a catheter in. I uh, still can't pee right. <laughs> That's not funny. Started watching the Fellowship, but got bored halfway through. Oh shit! I'm the other way around. I can't watch the Hobbit movies. Never seen such milking in all my life. And I live close to farms. It's a lot of milking. When. One and a half weeks left. Sorry, I didn't read that all the way. I'm a devil for doing that. Like, summer school, left for the kiddos. Night. And then, are you completely off then? Goes, or what are you going to do? Maybe it's a bit too much of an ask of a question, but did you get rid of the other job then to do that? It's probably none of my business. Start watching, yeah. Hey, in Dan. And Sandy, alright, there you go. I don't know what the hell. There's only so much. It's not it's not typos, people. And Ghoulie's actually waiting on food. And she's at a she's at a minus. She's got the shakes. 
She can almost smell the taco salad from here, but still not here. God damn it! That's what's wrong with her. That's why she can't type very well. Did you ever get that? Did you ever get the food shakes? Fuck me. You all get the alcohol shakes. And you start swigging a bit of Listerine just to get a kick. Fuck! <laughs> they won't serve me in my local Aldi anymore. Sir, it's half nine in the morning. Fuck off! Fuck off! And the codeine and the cough, the cough medicine's not doing it anymore for you. Can't straighten me out. This is this is true. This is true. Gotta iron that kilt while you're still wearing it. Holy bollocks! You're singeing me pubes. I really need to play this. Yeah, I I've been saving this little baby for ages. This is like the Void Heart Edition. It's just fancy speech for here's all the DLC. The, there's a sequel coming for the Switch called. Hollow Knight Silk Song, and you play as one of the characters in the game. The girl, her name is Hornet. It was fucking awesome. Like, even faster than this. Hornet's like a bee, right? I don't know where the silk comes into it. That was like a for first kind of mini boss or something. Look at me go, Mom! Doing it! Fucking doing it! Pyro's a hard case. He is. I want to meet him one day and, and arm wrestle him. Like that bit in Commando when, um, no, it wasn't Commando, it was Predator. Yeah, it was fucking Predator. Was it Predator? Yeah, it was Predator. When, uh, Arnie and the other dudes, like, the Apollo Creed from. You motherfucker. Stag Beetle! See, how are you supposed to avoid that shit? I don't have a back step or anything. Hold on, sir, I'm reading. He even gets the little map out. Look at the little Hollow Knight. He gets the map out! Get your maps out for the lads. Get your vaps out! Hello. Why am I fighting all these poor nice little bugs? Why can't we be fucked? Oh my god, false knight. That's what they call me. Oh, that can't be good. Oh, fuck your sound waves. Damn, I wasted like two regenerations so I don't understand the system yet. We all gonna die. Oh, fuck. We all gonna die sometimes. Stay golden pony, but fuck me. I didn't even rest, I don't even know how I found this. I swear it. I read a review in in a priest stream. <laughs> That's such a good antidote. I, I, what's it called? A good story to have. I was in a, a stream by a priest. Oh fuck. He just he just bing bang bong he bamboozled me in the middle of the air. Oh. Hello! I'm fucking dead! What are you doing? Feeling tired? That bench may be iron, but I assure you it's quite comfortable. Yeah, how do you know, you get bony ass bastard? There's no better place to collect your thoughts before heading below. Plus, I enjoy your company. That's fucking creepy! Why don't you sit down with me? Why you gotta stare behind me? Always watching, Lebowski. Tina Fey made the, the Diary of Wimper Kid. Okay, look, I, I trust you. We seem to have a good few movies in common. I trust you. I'm not gonna go out and watch it, though. I trust you. I'll take your word for it. God damn diary wimpy kid. I I've mentioned like too many guilty pleasures in these streams, man, I'm telling ya. I practically give people ammunition. Bad like I'm telling people like my weird fondness for, for movie, movie musicals like Moulin Rouge and Titanic. Titanic was a musical. Don't come at me with that shit. So you, now I have to find my geos, my dead body like souls. What is this? How have I missed this? What is this? Hello? This is why I need a map. Temple of the Black Egg? Are you... Hello? Hello there. He's wearing a mask. How delightful to meet another traveler on these forgotten roads. You're a short one, but you have a strong look about you. Thank you. I'm Quill. I have something of an obsession with uncharted places. This ancient kingdom holds many fascinating mysteries. And one of the most intriguing of them is standing right before us. A great stone egg lying in the corpse of an ancient kingdom. This egg? Is it warm? It certainly gives off a unique air. Can it be opened? There's strange marks all over it. I do so love a mystery, and who knows what other marvels lie deeper below us. It is kind of creepy. The three masks. We've seen that at the start of the game. That was pretty normal to, like, not like being told what to do. Mmm. 
Watch Brightburn. What was that like? I really want to watch that. That's the... Is it James Gunn that made that? It's like the anti-Superman movie or something. The kid thinks he's Superman. He just goes on a fucking killing spree. Did any of you guys watch the new movie from the Hereditary guys? Uh, Midsummer or something. It's spelled with an A. So it's like Midsummer. Some kind of weird like movies, right? Ever since it follows, there's these kind of weird sub-genre of psychological horrors or something. Arm wrestle me? Okay. Yeah, that's what we gotta do. First we hug, then we arm wrestle. Then we go out for pizza. I'll be back at my other job until they need me to sub. Interesting. And your other job didn't mind. That's so cool, Goose. I'm so... I'm glad for you. That's kind of why I asked. I didn't want you to be, like, out of... of you know, like, while you're waiting. Because I assume... Like, if you're a sub, they don't really care, kind of thing, you know? Like, hey, that's all we need you for. Uh, it probably doesn't even work on, like, a, a contract basis, is it? It's more like a semester basis. So long I felt drawn here, so many tales of wonders and horrors, no longer could I resist. I just had to see it for myself. And what time I chose to arrive, this dead world has sprung back to life. After we opened it back up, the creatures are riled up and the earth rumbles. The air is thick. I wonder what could have brought it all about. I think oh, it was Ghoulie watching oh, Wimpy Kid, man, I'm telling you. To perse oh, persevere in this room? That old nail alone just won't be enough. Though it's, it's no problem. Can you help me? Plenty have come before us and most have met their grisly end. Many more are equipped. You and I. I'm sure they wouldn't mind where a fella explore. Does he relieve them of their tools? Are you going to let me upgrade my stuff? Quirrell. Are you just going to chill here? Not Past the town of Bobo, a gloomy little place, and such majesty hidden right beneath. I suppose that's why we're all headed down here. Who could resist such possibilities? Truly a marvel. You always want to exhaust the dialogue, because sometimes you just miss, like, whole quests and shit. No, there's nothing else in here. This seems to be some kind of altar. Three deities, three bug queens or some shit. Uh, I feel like Google would be one of those teachers that all kids... Yeah, exactly! Never look up. Another man's killed. No, you should never. No, I, I definitely agree with you there. I think people would learn a lot from girls. Shit, since I've known her, she's taught me a thing or two. <laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> Haven't watched anything. Yeah, yeah. That's all good. I know you don't like horror movies. It's good. That makes... You know, it's, it's the funny thing about you. You don't really like... Um, not funny thing, but it's just... You know, in this day and age, every kid's like drinking at 12... Doing heroin at 13. It's a wild world. La 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 la. Remember that? Was that Cat Stevens? I think it was. Baby, I'm grieving. So if you wanna leave, take good care. Hope you make another life friends out there. But yeah, what the hell? I got I got sidetracked. Musically sidetracked. Um yeah, you don't seem to like horror or, like, any nasty talk. Any of that nasty shit! You keep that nasty shit to yourself! Ah, oh, son, son of bitch! Son of b oh, super son of bitch. Son of bitch. I heard they are bringing the mask back. Again. Son of mask. Baby, I'm grieved. Of course, the fucking game doesn't pause when you're in the menus because why would we ever do that? Who dad? Who dad? I need to get my shit back. Thank you, please. Thank you, Jeez. I think that's why it's all cracked. I'm a bit cracked. Yeah, Mids Midsummer could be cool. I want to watch uh, Us as well. I like to get out. This is an interesting take on it. Oh, there's that grub sleeping up there. I'm sorry, I will get you when I can. You needy bastard. I mean, you're so cute. I love you. Bye bye. Can't for yeah. I didn't watch it one yet, even though like I'm a huge Stephen King fan. I don't know why. I've been very apprehensive with any remakes lately. Um, and I should just bite the bullet. 
I want to watch the Pet Cemetery remake because I think that I think Stephen King's television, a lot of his stuff was television mini movies and all that. They were very, they had that made for TV shine. I still think they hold up very well, but just like kind of like uh in a way, you know. So I don't mind that as much. I think that's fine. I think uh, I would love to see like um, let me see. Uh, Tommy Knockers would be fucking awesome to get a remake because I think that story is awesome. Um, it's getting done. Stand would be great as well. It's a it's a hefty bitch. It's the biggest book I've ever read. Fourteen hundred pages. Almost broke the spine in half. Um, yeah, it's getting done. Carrie's been done to death. God bless her. And that new word Carrie is not great. It's kind of there's nothing wrong with it. It's just kind of pointless. It's kind of like okay, okay. You know, it doesn't. How the fuck do I get back down there? And change the meter either way. What's this? I have no idea how to get back down there. I think that's completely locked. That little thing with the shadows, I think I gotta get the. Baby, I'm leaving. Three films, Butter Bear, Edward Scissor's Hands, and Elf. <laughs> well, you've got all the bases covered right there, dude. <laughs> you you never need to watch another movie. <laughs> I thought you watched like Rockies and all that. Man, you fucking li you lying? Why the fuck you lying? Oh my god, did that kill me? Jeez, I'm not really understanding what's going on here. I'm getting my ass handed me. Why does it have to load it back if you fall in the hole? God damn. I can't lose my shit this early. Add Home Alone 1 and 2 to that list. That's all you need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Yeah. Home Alone 3 and 4 don't exist. Was oh, there a Home Alone with a girl in it? Or am I thinking of the Karate Kid? The next Karate Kid. After the next Karate Kid. What about American Ninja? American Ninjas? Or Three Ninjas? Yeah, Three Ninjas. American Ninja or something else. Everyone forgets about... Ninjas. The hell I gotta do to get some respect down here. At least we found the first boss. Now it's just a matter of finding them. I like how the shells are little wagons. It's cute. It's cute. Reminds me of Bugs Life for ants. Anybody remember ants with a Z? It was like the poor man's poor man's bug life, you know, when your parents couldn't avoid Fuck you. Couldn't afford Bugs Life. You had to get ants instead. Ants with Sylvester Stallone in it. As the big fucking ants. You know what I'm saying? Jennifer Lopez in there for no fucking reason. Ants. I loved ants. Woody Allen was in it as well, like crazy little bastard. <laughs> How about you stop humming and you teach me which way to go? You used to call me on the cell phone. Now you're just writing maps. Just, just the right way. It's supposed to be a little bench that you can chill and get a save, but I don't know. You'd expect them to have one close to. Close to you. What's this here? Is this where I just was? No, it's not. It's a hot spring. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Now we're going to relax here, children. Okay, children. What's notches mean? Unequipped. I can't hover over the notches. Oh. We'll find out soon enough. Yeah, space balls. Fuck yeah. Space balls. Airplane. Blazing saddles. Young Frank. I fucking all... I don't think there is such thing as a bad Mel Brooks movie. Is this the right way? So how do you get your geodes back? You just pick them up? Pick them up! Yo, it's a couple of Peruvian hitchhikers. Pick them up! Ma King Bird Sing Mockingbird I'm gonna take Have you heard about the fucking Mockingbird? Shit! When that fucking bird don't sing, gonna buy you a fucking diamond ring. 
Come on, Ray. Where's this boss? Shitty. Look, I'm gone too far. How the fuck do you get back there? Dumb on ring. That whole bit in Dumb and Dumber was all improvised. How fucking cool is that? It's like one of the funniest parts of the whole fucking movie. Damn. The funny thing is, I don't know how the fuck that movie worked. Like, Jim Carrey, awesome. But Jeff. Jeff Daniels, like. Not always known for his comedy. My god, does he not fucking... That's one of those movies where they both, like, almost steal the show. The whole way, so... Schmackadoo! Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Chrysler. Where do I go, game? It's like I happen... What the fuck is that? It's making all sorts of noise. It's like a... It's like a... Fossil or something. So is this game go... Yeah, I'm, I'm liking it so far. It's a, uh, it's like living in a in a bug's hive, so it's a bit confusing. A oh, boss. I never meant to do this. Shit. I just gotta find out where to go. You see, it's right there. How the hell did I find it that time? Hmm. See those two little eyes, the little white eyes, right in the center of the map. That's where I gotta go. This fucking map maker, whatever the hell he's called. Cartographer. Bastard didn't help me. You son of a bitch, you knew what you were doing, didn't you? It's a sickness. Tell you one thing I hear about the summer as well, the, all the heat. The amount of bugs, man. You can't leave your fucking window open. Two minutes. My stupid flies fucking come in. Oh, I thought this was... A fucking McDonald's! No, bitch, it's Burger King. Oh fuck! I guess I'll, I guess I'll stay and have some food. Now, why are you gonna stay in Burger King when you're gonna bitch and moan about it, and you know we have inferior fries? Inferior fries! That's what you start calling them. Get your new Burger King inferior fries. Same shitty fries, same shitty price. Yeah, I think out of the whole lot of Burger King got the worst fries. I don't know how to find this fucker. Maybe it's this way. No, this is where this bastard is. Why won't you help me? Please. I don't know where I am. Yeah, what what a what a uh, transition from Wolfenstein to this. That's how we roll. Hello Kitty was off the table. No Kitty. I am assuming there's gonna be like a double jump later. I can already kind of feel it on the button. That's how these games work. They give you a little piece of little dashes and double jumps and flips and all sorts of cool shit. Dips and dives and dodges. Drivers and dives and dips. I can go for it. Dips. Is this it? I think this might be it. Why it's not filled out in the map is anybody's guess. I don't know how that works yet. I just need to find... Oh, this is where the grub was. I need to find a bench. Not like a good bench, I'm telling you. Benches are underrated. Why you guys sit in the bench? Ponder about life. Where the hell was that boss? Damn it, these guys always seem to roll up on you. Like, that time it just right. Wouldn't get me started on these guys. That mocking bird on Saint Bird on Saint. Shit, now I'm stuck in my head. Are you happy? You do not know this power you wield. I hope this is the right way. It's not even showing up on the map that I'm here. So, 
It's not like fog of war. It's not. It doesn't open up like that. No, I went this way. Fuck! How do I get back down there? I don't want to go too far. No. Shit! I think I plugged this PS4 controller into the Xbox to charge and it seems to be working. I was probably pressing all sorts of stuff on the Xbox. Oh, you bastards. It's gotta be here somewhere. What the fuck? I can't. I don't even zoom in anymore on the map. I think once you sort. You kind of figured out the map. Uh, it probably kind of make more sense. One of those things, once you know, you know, you know. Sometimes you don't really know, you know. Fuck! Can't even cancel that. That's how he heals. The noise that thing makes. It's like one of those people, like, they're. They don't. You offer them something for free and they're like, they turn it down. But then they'll complain about it afterwards. It's like, no, I'm fine. It's like, are you sure now? I'm leaving the shop. I'm not coming back in. I'm not getting you an ice cream. No, it's fine. It's fine. And you're there, like, eating your popsicle. They're like, ah, I really want to go. <laughs> Shit. Teach me something, game. I can't read your gibberish. There's one little exit I'm missing. Is it past this little bastard? No. It looks like there's something there, though. I was too busy in conversation. I did not take any of that in. <laughs> I'm going to find me. Is it this way? No, it looks like there's something there, right? Little gate. Little donkey. Little donkey. Is that what that means? Does that mean like a boss? Those, I don't know what those signs mean. On the dusty trail. Fuck you, man. Get your ass up there. Hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, that's what the sign is. These little springs. I see springs in so many games. Hot springs and stuff. I ain't never been in a hot spring. I've never been in a sauna yet, either. Like a proper, like, fucking public bathhouse shit. I don't think Irish people are ready for that yet. Mm-mm. How the hell can you not get up there? I love this art style. I can't wait to see what else to do with it later. Get wrecked, mosquito. What up, dude? What up, mosquito? Skate, skate, mosquito. Ah, damn, this is Mosquito City. There's another one? Shut up, DJ Khaled. No one asked you. This way? No, I can't tell what's a door and what's not. Find it's a door, or not a door. Fuck you. Alright, sorry, I won't do that one again. Is this it? We may never know. I made it, Mom! You proud of me? Fuck off. I ain't your mom! You can't stay in the post office all day. Sorry, Mom. Mom be crazy when she's working in the post office. I'm not to get. Fuck this, man. I love you, Mom! I get free stamps! 
get to sit in the high chair and spin it around. I fucking love you, Mom. I don't know you. Get your free stamps. Everybody gets free. It's free stamp day. This, this guy is fucking crazy. I love my mom and I love my stamps. Come on, there's gonna be a bench here. That dude's pretty fucking hard to fight, though. I will say that. I hear you. Bricky, bricky, oh, bricky, bricky. What is this? Where is big bitches? Big chunga. I ain't fighting you again, dude. Ain't nobody got time for that. I got time, but ain't nothing for that. Fucking bastard lands on you every time. That vibration might get old. Just about enough. Was this the room? I think so. It's got to be a. Yeah, fuck this, man. Fuck this, man. Is this not. Yeah. Where's the, my souls? This is this music, though. My dead body? Music is kind of trippy. Music kind of fades away. Doo -doo -doo. You little bastard, you always find a way. What the heck? What is that? But it's... Is, it, is that me? Like my shadow. Oh, you fucking bastard. It actually attacks you. Alright. Damn. Looks like you're gonna have to fight to get your souls back. You gotta fight! Got him. 166. Damn, I got loads now. It's not where the boss is again, though. Pfft. Yep. Damn, there's nowhere to go there. I suppose they're going. Is I'm dead? Ew! <laughs> That's fucking nasty. I swear to Jesus and God in heaven. Whoa, he's. Oh my god, he's going fucking crazy over there. Damn, you didn't give me much room to go anywhere, motherfucker. Oh! Please don't die not like this. We ain't going out like this. Come on, people. Get fucked, boy. Blue. It's like a glow worm in armor. That's nice, dude. It's gonna get fucked. Oh, it's gonna get fucked. God damn it. There's absolutely nowhere to fucking rest there. I don't think these hot springs are normal. Like milk or something. Milk of magnesia. That shit's fucking nasty. I almost had him there. I'm still trying to figure out can I like hold the heal button and keep healing or whatever the fuck that does. Do you have a name, I wonder? They all have names. Those noises, though, my god. Sound like a fucking queef. Queen the queef! I wonder how you get more life as well. I have five little things. He was doing like. He'll do like two damage, I think. With that big slam. Slam a damn. Real bastard. 
It probably won't get like to cuphead levels of rage. Sweet Jesus! I seen that the delay the uh, the DLC for that. At this point, like it's kind of what happened with Dying Light. At this point, you're better off just stop and turn it into a whole new game. Dying Light like went on and on and on with DLC. It was still cool. And hopefully, whatever they've learned from it, they can just add to uh, Dying Light 2 and like boom, thanks a million. Motherfucker! He always gets one. This guy, jumping Pete. Jumping Pete Sampras. So I can't build up the same level of mana because it's broken. Mm. Let's get it fixed. I have to I have to kill the shadow of my former self. Ah, you see what I did there? How come I died so easy that time? Give me such a hard time. These guys are here just to give you mana before the fight, right? That's exactly what you guys are. You're just fodder. Fodder. False mate, that was his name. Ah. To God damn! Oh man, to, to dodge that that sound wave, shock wave, half impossible. Look at him go, Jeffrey. Greedy boy. Oh, you dirty bitch. Bring it. Should be here. Whale on him! Oh, come on, he's got another one? Those animations are awesome. He, f he fucking fell! He fell! Oh, it's like a part two? How come I only got 350 of my Geo things back? That fucking sucks. Is he still alive? Is the Geo thing still alive? Got him! Oh, there's the glow one. Man, I almost feel bad. What did you drop, my dude? City Crest. And our first boss is down. La 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 la. Oh, what the fuck? What are you? Are you dead? Oh. Reminds me of that thing from Bubba and Sticks. Who knows what that thing was about? Well, I'm missing some geodes here. 350 ain't worth a damn. Did some of them disappear or something? I had like 500 and something. Did I die again? I don't think so. I picked it up last time. Bastards. They took like easily 3 or 4. Whoa! That's just treasure. Oh, cool, you can go into the treasure chest. That's so funny. Damn, we really need to get one of those magnets or something. I need to be able to swoop and get all of these. Look, you can have a little house. This is my house. It's beautiful. It's got a beautiful view. It's uh, on the lake. I love it. And at about 4.15 p.m. the sun hits it beautifully. It comes through the butthole of the house. This is the butthole of the house. Yeah, if you had to like... Name each part of the house after a body part. Think about it. Zibotol. Uh, 
Oh, there's something over that gap. The Sally gap. Slightly pissed they robbed me of geodes or geos. Geo dudes. Can never have enough geo dudes. I used to have a whole Pokemon box full of geo dudes for no damn reason. Put them all together. I got geo dudes. You go into a town, your man's like, "Yo, I'll trade you this EV for a Dratini." I'm like, "Shit, I really want a Dratini." Will you take sixty-four geo dudes? Uh, you know I'm good for it. I don't want your damn geo dudes. Just shut up and take the Geo Dudes. I'll also throw in a high potion. Oh shit. This must be shortcuts. I love shortcuts, me! Oh what's this now? Is this the cartographer? Hello! Sorry I missed you! If you're feeling lost, why not pop up in our store in Dirt Mode and purchase a map? Okay. I will do that. Why did you leave this here? Look at the fucking mess you left here! You're a litter bug! You're literally a litter bug. You son of a bitch. I gotta go clean this up. Got the council breathing down my fucking mouth. God damn it. Oh god you. We're trying to win the tidy towns of America. Tidy tiny titties of America. Yeah, why is all these all the women gonna have big titties? What about tiny titty of America? All you need is a handful. Ah the good old butthole. Little remage. Oh sweet Jesus. That that sounds like a British village, doesn't it? Welcome to Little Rimmage. Yes, we know. <laughs> Sometimes you can't you can't change the name. How are you liking Hollow Knight? I enjoy it. Yeah, it's it's a lot. I think that was just the first boss I killed. Um, it's fun. Very. I'm trying to figure out what's going on with the uh, map. It's a little bit hard to understand. It's a little bit different. They want you to actually put a little work in. But I suppose maybe they don't want you to use the map at all. Kind of thing. Ooh, this is some grand... Grand Pooba. Timon and Pooba. Let's go and have a look, see. I want to see what Timon and Pooba look in the new Lion King. Oh shit, here we go. Look at this dude. We can rest here? Nice. I can think about life and stuff. Ah, life and stuff. Yeah, snail, shaman. <laughs> snail shaman, cool. This makes sense. All high and mighty in their movable houses. Snails are the RVs of the bug world, aren't they? Who is that creeping out of the darkness? My, you're looking grim. A strange, empty face and a wicked looking weapon. Something important has drawn you down to Hallonet's corpse. But I won't ask what. Perhaps the reason you found me is because you need my help. Say no more, my friend. I'm going to give you a gift. A nasty little spell of my own creation. It's just perfect for a little one like you. Oh, condescending motherfucker. I'll take your free gift though. Ooh. Jeez, my neck is in bits. Bike ride was worth it. Yeah, break everything. That's the way to do it. That's the that's the Dark Souls way. What did you give me? You got a cutscene? Vengeful spirit. I like it. Tap. Oh, okay. Release the spirit. Spells will deplete soul, which is like mana. And Geo is like souls. I know it's confusing, right? Ah, oh, shit. You know when you get on a bike and you haven't you haven't ridden a bike in a while. I know that expression like get on the bike, but uh. Fuck that. I got like some serious muscle chafing going on or something, goddamn. The inner inner ties, if you know what I'm talking about. Inner inner inner. The full blast power! Something happened to our snail friend that did die? Oh no, there you are. You've woken at last! I apologize. Perhaps I should have warned you about the power of that spell. I was watching over you as you slept. You creepy bitch, but seem to have slipped away myself. Now you're awake, I was wondering whether you'd do me a small favor. Well, you've trapped me in here. I can't get out. Not as a repayment of my gift, of course. Of course not, yeah. Yeah, that's not what she wants at all. Simply because we're now friends. Alright. Hard little beast. It looks like I'm stuck down here. Okay, that's probably the second second boss. It's a hardy creature, but you know power more than a match with. Okay. I like this. Give me all the powers. Can I get up here? See, look, looks like there's gonna be something to do later. Got a char uh, charm that I got first. See, what the fuck does that mean? That thing looks like balloons, but it's not. It's the little shaman dude. Alright. Oh, yeah, let's try Vengeful Spirit. Hold still! Oh my god. 
I think I should apologize. That guy, he, he won't even come back as a larva or nothing. Ancestral mound. Oh, fuck. I was, I'm, I'm reading something, you ignorant bitch. That was one of those, like, little armored shell bugs. I like this. Can you imagine what they're going to do with the different types of enemies and stuff. I would love a pet armadillo myself. Armadillo. All oh, these heads, man. They look like our heads. That's not good. Can you kill them? Alright, cool. Yeah, I just went around in a big circle. How you doing? I'm fucking fantastic. How did you hit me? I like this healing mechanic. Kind of reminds me of, um... Sort of like how Blood Bomb, it's a bit slower, like... Where... This, my soul meter is going up, so... Yeah. For being aggressive, you know? When you heal... For being aggressive, sort of. God damn mosquitoes! You're not a full mosquito, you're just a mosquito. Mosquito, mosquito! I knew you were there. I could smell you. Yeah, I saw like... Obviously I was watching E3, so I've seen the trailer for Silk Song, the sequel. And the speed of her! She, and she's kind of a noisy... She's kind of a noisy chick. The speed of her. I like that you've got... Oh my god. Oh, is this how you kill him now? Ah, bitch, I got your number. Oh, he spits this shit too. Damn! Get smacked by the little baby. Both y'all can get smacked. And then he spits one out so he can get more soul to keep attacking him. I see what you're doing. Damn. Timing is so... F oh, you fucking bastard. Damn it. He's a little fast fucker. Got him. I think he's a little baby should laugh. What the hell it did? We're learning, now we can get past the soul catcher. Oh, where the fuck did she just go? Uses shamans to draw more soul from the world around you. Increase the amount of soul gain when striking an enemy with the nail. The nail is kind of an unusual thing. Like, I don't know. Would never have thought that for it. It looks more like a lance or a joust lance. Hey, I'm back. Is that who you're talking about? So it's done, you've slain the beast. The poor thing, it must have been terrible to you. It used to be quite docile, but the rancid air in these caverns filled up with some ancient rage. Still, you did what had to be done. You have my gratitude. Of course, we both know you wouldn't have made it through without that spell of mine. Thank you. And look, the gate between us has opened. I wonder how. I wonder why. You son of a bitch. It's just another lemon tree. Get in my belly, I'm higher in the food chain. Yeah, that little guy. This little Hollow Knight's eating everybody. Everybody! Alright, Mr. Snail. Why is that crap around me? Why do you hesitate? You still got nothing for me, I'm afraid. Though I admire your persistence. Ho ho ho! See this, what's this black stuff? Means I'm nearly dead or something? Is that better? That was weird. Menoni. Menoni. It sounds like a uh, Simoleon, the, the Sim language. Is that what it was called? I know the money was called that. Can I rest in your bed? Now I can equip this charm. Are you allowed to equip too? What's this notches thing all about? A notch on your bedpost. Damn! Hollow Knight, you pimp! What if he's like a woodlice and he genuinely has notches on his bedpost because he's fucking eating the thing? I hate woodlice. Alright, so where do we go from here? Where do we go from here? Boom! Time is it? It's almost midnight. Yeah, I got one boss done. It's been a little bit too long. Yeah, cool. Alright, let me find a weird point and I'll probably call it. This is fun! I, I, I could get lost in this for hours. That's a good sign. Bam, bam, bam. And then, like, me having the switch, like, the way indies are going lately, there's no doubt about it that they're favor favoriting uh, switch, you know? You know when people do that thing where they get like five glasses of water 
they filled them in different heights of water and they play songs on them and shit. It's fucking crazy. I always tried to do that as a kid, but I couldn't do it. Oh shit. I like the boote catcher. Boote! Boote. Shabooty. Man, I am fucking wrecked, but I'm so happy playing these games. So chill. I wonder how you get over here. I have broken the floor and I can't get up. Don't lie, we've all been there, right? Falling to the floor and I can't get up. The world's best mayonnaise. Because food loves helmets. Well, you know what? Food can go on loving helmets because I fucking hate that shit. Mayonnaise is overrated and overused. Bitch, did I ask for mayonnaise? No. But then you just assumed for both of us, didn't you? And you know what a summon does? It makes an ass out of you and me? No! A summon means I'ma kick your ass! I paid good money and you have tainted and tarnished this beautiful sandwich! Take it back! Let it leave my presence and come back mayonnaise-less. Do you ever feel like that someday? You just can't get up out of bed? You're mayonnaise-less. No energy. No self. Devoid of self. Also known as mayonnaise-less. Mayo, mayo, mayonnaise. It's, it's better to say than it is to eat. Mayonnaise, the secret treat for your feet. Studies, scientists have found. Like you always hear this shit, right? Scientists have found. Fuck off. No scientists found that. Some kinky bastard put mayonnaise on his feet and found that it made his feet all greasy and weird. Like, who gives a shit? Scientists have found that rubbing your nipples clockwise will actually reduce the aging process by- No! No, that doesn't work! Putting an onion by your ankle will actually cure earaches. That's the biggest sort of shite! They're not called an old wives tale, they're called Mama was a drunk. <laughs> <That's what's... laughs> Mama was a drunk, she did some crazy shit. Kids, I woke up with a clove of garlic in my ear again. Oh, that's mama for you. All right, I think this is actually where we need to use this spell. Look, I was right. Now he starts spitting this shit. You see what I'm talking about? That's what everybody's talking about. Hey, hey, you, you. I don't like your weird little babies. Stop pissing them out. Are you spitting out babies? That's not where the babies come from. First the babies come from the bum. That's what the belly button's for. Then... The seeds come out of the belly button and you, you, you plant the belly button seeds in the cabbage patch and you get a cabbage patch kid. The end. Wow. That's life. And this is stomach bile. Look at this. They tell you to take alka and You take the alka and your stomach feels like this. You start breaking wind at the train station. Even the old women are like, fuck this shit, I'm out. The old ladies like, accidental toots. It's part of life now. Walking around behind her and she's like old faithful. Just a geyser goes off every now and then. <laughs> You're like, the hell that? What the hell was that? Jesus, God is talking to me. It's it's encounters of the third kind. <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> what in the hell is going on? The aliens are coming to take me home. No, that's just grandma. Damn, that's cool. Musical toots. The more you eat, the more she toots. I love you, Grandma, but we gotta get a hold of that asshole. It's gone to hell. The green part. This is lovely. What should actually be like... Bacteria or some shit. Actually, it really sounds... The fizz, it sounds like Pop Rocks. Can you hear that? I'm gonna turn it up. Because I'm super loud out there. Sounds like Pop Rocks in your ears. Remember those pop rocks? And they're like, don't leave them on your tongue too long. By God, you do that until that shit hurts. I bet you that's what they did. They recorded pop rocks. Now, there's not enough crack men, but the sizzle's there. Ah! Not that feeling, yeah. The new face loss. Oh, accidental shards. Oh, shit. We must not go that far. There's no coming back, right? No coming back. One time you're far away from home. That's the new Homeward Bound movie. 
keep bringing up Homer Bound lately. I don't know why. My brain is a mystery, unbeknownst to myself. Surprises and shocks me on the daily. Alright, I like the music too. Only you can save naturally anywhere, but I'll, I'll probably just mess around with it off camera a little bit, get a bit more adjusted. Oh cool, the more you jump around, the little leaves. <laughs> jump around! Jump around! Look, it's like autumn in America. Hey, I spent four hours rigging up those leaves. Have at it, motherfuckers. You turn around, put the broom away. And you turn around, you put the rake away, it's not a broom. And the kids have kicked the fucking shit, goddamn neighbor kids! God damn bastards! It took me four fucking hours, man! God damn. <laughs> it's always a bloody way. Just I can't believe we're almost in August. What the hell is going on? Uh, what's the next big game for you, Swampy? Long street. Yeah, but well, see, I want to get back to doing this, but more like two and two. Today I was more like, you know, nearly four and two. Because I'm fine doing that. I ra actually would rather not end the stream in a way, because I can just change streams, but it's just easier if I end the stream, I can split it up easier. I know you can do certain things you can do, but... And then, in a way, like, if it's a new game, I don't like sending out a whole lot of notifications, but sometimes people might like the other game differently or whatever, you know? Yeah, the years pass by, I swear to God. I think, like, Wolfenstein Youngblood should be fun. Be a nice kind of appetizer close out the summer. I'm excited for um, Control as well, that could be cool. But Remedy usually are similar to that, they'll do like a 8 or 10 hour campaign, that's kind of all the game has to offer, you know? Whether it's Adam Wake or Quantum Break. All their, all their games almost rhyme. Max Payne, Alan Wake, Quantum Break, Mom Gay. I enjoyed that one the most. Uh, control, yeah, control looks cool. It reminds me so much of that PS2 game, PsyOps. PsyOps the Conspiracy or something. It's one of those games where you're able to just move everything around the place. So much fucking fun. Yeah, Star Wars is gonna be great. I'll be definitely getting that. I might even get the new Call of Duty. Like, it looks like it might be coming back into my territory with the campaign stuff, which I always kind of preferred. Yeah, Death Stranding. That's in September, isn't it? Jesus, September is stacked to fuck. I'm hoping to get a little Switch. I probably won't get it like in the Prime sale bullshit. I'll end up checking out eBay or something. They're very expensive over here. The whores, they know exactly what they're doing. Everything becomes a collector's item even when it's not. I think one of them was asking for 1700 euro for one of the collector's edition Switches or something. <laughs> Can keep it. Fuck me, he's a gold plated cardboard or some shit. Now, he here is your Burger King Burger Whopper with a golden flake on top. Get that shit out of here, motherfuckers. That Dying Light 2 would release. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm just glad that it's confirmed to be coming and it looks great. They keep emphasizing on the choice system. I'm like, oh, okay, I don't really care. Like, we all know that you're gonna get the same cutscene at the end of the game kind of thing, right? But still, looks cool. Dying Light was such a such a surprise. We all were expecting just another Dying or Dead Island, you know. There's nothing as nothing wrong with Dead Island. It's just kind of like after about three hours of Dead Island, you're kind of like, okay, I've seen everything I need to see. But then you get the grappling hook in Dying Light, and you're like, holy fuck, it's Spider-Man with zombies. But uh, yeah, Dead Island 2, I don't know. Like there was a big fight in in the. And the developer, and then they split off and created Techland or something like that, I think. And that's when Dying Light happened, and you could tell they pretty much took nearly the whole idea of Dead Island and was like, fuck it, let's make it serious. Grappling hook, Bob's your fanny. It was so much better. Yeah, no, we definitely have enough to tie us over. Gears 5 should be good as well. I'm I'm kind of pissed how long it's taken for like Ori to come out. Like I don't I don't really mind Cuphead as much because uh, I can understand how long that takes. But then when you hear stuff about a Cuphead Netflix series and all this kind of shit, you're kind of like you're delaying it on purpose. You're working on these fucking side projects, which I know is important for a brand and stuff. But I'd rather see Cuphead be put on you know PS4 and everything. Like get it everywhere. That'll help the devs. Yeah. 
That's, that's the thing, isn't it? You would probably agree, Swampy. The indie games are really kind of pushing the envelope now. And they're at the point where, back in the day, you'd play an odd indie game and you go, Oh, this is kind of fun, but it never... You know, even the Limbos and all that. We all remember them, but Limbo was a very much like one and done kind of playthrough. It's cool to come back to it on new consoles and five, ten years later, but... You know, it's one and done. Nowadays, like the likes of like Don't Starve and Auction Not Included and Hollow Knight and all these games, they... You would put hundreds of hours into them. Easy. It's fucking awesome. They really have taken over the double A side where um, they're not indie and they're not huge big ass budget games. I just hope the prices don't keep coming up. I want to play that Sea of Solitude as well. I still might get it though. It's kind of lost the run of myself last week. I just hit my wall I think and I'm like I've got so much shit to do. I'm putting up with all this kind of stuff in the back burner and then the engine just kind of blew. I had to take my spinach. Yeah, making a stand. I'm I'm happy. I'm really happy. Like something like a way out. Did you play a way out that prison escape game? Jesus Christ, games like that like and Hellblade! Hellblade was nearly like one of my fucking games of the year for that year. It was 2016, 2017? Jesus Christ. That game was only 30 bucks, and I'm like, I would have no problem spending 60 on this. And they put it on Xbox and I wanted to play it again. Yeah, Way Out was really cool. Even a Mr. Bug! <laughs> Old guy, how are you doing, dude? How was your weekend, man? I'm just wrapping up now. I just played about two hours of this. So good to finally get and play Hollow Knight. And it and makes me even more hyped. See, Hollow Knight 2, I think, is only coming on the Switch as well. I've, I've, I've about a dozen games or so that I want to play on the Switch, so it definitely will get its work out. Be interesting to, like, stream stuff as well and... You know, being over on Twitch anyway, it doesn't really matter with that kind of stuff. Nintendo being dicks. They're kind of eased up now and they're a bit better, but there's still like people getting hit a lot of us. Yeah, Hellblade, Jesus. Th those guys are working on like a, an Overwatch style game. Might be too late. But it sounds like a, like a, not like a side game, but sort of like a Team 2 game. Bleeding Edge, I think it's called. The, I bet you the Hellblade team are actually working on it something, something. It was crazy, like, fucking Double Fine is now owned by Microsoft. But they said Psychonauts 2 would still be on, like, PS4 and everything. So I think, I think when the way things are going with Microsoft, they're happy enough to put everything on everything. They just want the bottom line now. Had a good weekend. Yeah, my weekend was great. Um, I was really busy on Saturday. I was, I, there was a leak in the ensuite bathroom, so I had to pull down the whole plasterboard ceiling and... Put that back up. That was fun. It's actually kind of weirdly therapeutic because I could just like end up taking out everything. You just get I got, I got the hook of the hammer and I was just wailing on it. It was like something out of a fucking movie. And then Sunday I went out to my parents' place and kind of convinced them to go on a bike ride, a bicycle ride. That was fun down the canal and stuff. Some nice countryside out there, you know. Really, and it's really overgrown now because of the intense heat we've been getting. So you get a little bit of rain and then it grows like fucking. Amazon jungle, you know, you're like, Christ almighty. It's always fun, then you see, like, the barges going by and stuff. It's funny, Ireland with the bit of sun, you know, we just turn into a different country when in the sun. Everybody running around half naked. And, uh, everybody, you know, everybody like fucking sunbathing. You sunbathing in the middle of the road at the cut. I'd fry an egg on your stomach. Yeah, and I played some Wolfenstein as well earlier, which was... That was really fun, so it's a weird contrast today, but I liked it. It's exactly what I wanted to do. I was thinking about it all weekend. I'm like, ooh! And then yesterday I was messing around putting that little Twitter video together. It's like a 30 second thing. I like it though, it kind of allows me to put a little effort in. Usually I keep the games I'm going to play secret. But, um, I don't know, it's kind of... That's one of those double-edged swords, right? Where... You're like, oh, if I keep it secret, it's more surprise. People never know what you're going to play. But then they never know what you're going to play, so they're not going <laughs> to... You can't win. I don't really like schedules or planning in general too much. Because I find that um, when it's fixed like that, you do end up like thinking, overthinking it. And it almost counts down like a timer. Then I want to see some of that naked. Yeah, that's true. Believe me, they're not all ginger here. Sounds like I need to visit. <laughs> schedule, a yeah, yeah, definitely. I, I actually tell a lot of people, I'm like, don't even bother with a schedule if you don't want to. 
like, it's nice to be consistent, though. That's kind of weird, right? It's like, try and be consistent without having a schedule. I found, like, once every, like, three days sometimes it seems to be better. It's weird. But yeah, you want to get into all that algorithm shite and you'll go mad in the head. You'll turn into fucking Johnny from... What's his name? Johnny from uh, The Shining. Honest to God. You go mad in the head. Writing on the ball and stuff. Yes, but if I do it this, at this hour, at this hour, and I got two extra legs, oh my god, oh my god, I'm do it. <laughs> it's crazy how it takes over. And they know that. YouTube and Twitch know all about that. They know what they're doing. You make it about numbers and gamify it, people will try and reach goals and grind, grind, grind and stuff. Anyway, I'll catch you at long. Yeah! I know, I appreciate that, Swampy. Thank you, dude. Hopefully, I want to keep it tight as I can, so it is two and two, you know. That's what I always used to do, and just lately I've noticed that I've just, I'll just play a game and kind of relax into it and be four or six hours. But yeah, that's mainly motivation, tiredness, the heat and all that kind of stuff as well. It all kind of bogs you down. I kind of got a refresher at the weekend, which is much needed. Maybe I need a new hobby. Pole dancing. Male pole dancing. Keep your fit, get your core doing. What do you think, guys? Would you watch streams of me learning how to pole dance? It's awesome. It's awesome. No male pole dancing? <laughs> yeah, you gotta take breaks. Yeah. I usually do it at the weekend. Change time. Yeah. I know, it was, no, it was all over the place. Last, like, week or two, it's been all over the place. So you can kind of tell. If you, if you notice my, um, my streaming times change a lot, or if I miss a day, that's usually an indicator, you know? And I don't see that indicator until I'm like, okay, now I'm going to burn out if I don't stop. Well, I miss a day, I go, okay, today I'm just not going to stream, or something comes up. Obviously, in the back of my mind, I probably needed it. Just, yeah. Yeah, but I know it's, it's still always fun to me, you know, it's, it's the funny thing with me, it's kind of the, it's always the game is first, that's the thing that gets me into a stream. And then it's you guys, you know, just hanging out, because I'll be doing this anyway. So I'm always like, oh, I really want to, because I've been dying to play Hollow Knight, and I'll play this a bit off screen. The same with Bloodstained as well, it's games like that, and then there's other games you'll either get stuck, or there's a boss, or just, just having a bad stream, and it can leave a bit of a bad taste in your mouth. You're like, I don't want to come back to that. Times of day. It's just gone midnight. Quarter past midnight. Yeah, Bloodstain's fantastic. I only thing I'd say is maybe wait till it comes down a little bit. They want like 40 bucks for it now, and it's a little bit steep for indie game. Even if it is a beautiful love letter to Castlevania, it would be lovely at 20 bucks. I'm I'm glad. Yeah, almost. Yeah, there you're dead right. Oh guy, you you hit the nail on the head. Yeah, it is late. Ah, it's not so bad. I mean, I try and hit up your guys stream, and sometimes it's like two in the morning. It's okay, like, I'm pretty good on, like, four or five hours sleep anyway, and I'm happy about that. If I get any more than, like, if I get, like, six, seven, I'm all fucked up. My body's all weird all over the place. I notice if I get these weird, like, power naps, but obviously it, it, I run into, um, a wall with that as well. Like, people always ask me, where do you sleep? When do you sleep? When do you do that? I'm like, I fucking sleep when I'm fucking sleep. <laughs> like, three or four hours, you know? I'm usually good. What I try and do is, um, if someone's streaming at like 5 or 6 a.m., I'll just get up by then, you know? So I'm in work by fucking. Gone out of the house like a half a quarter, man. Little after four here. West Coast. Yeah, come. You, have you been getting any of those earthquakes, old guy? Are you a bit north? Pretty fucking crazy. I know it's all done now. Maybe it was a bit blown out of proportion, but still, the first one, that 7.2 or whatever it was, was insane. There's no lying about that. Yeah, that guy was at Re Relia, Relia. He he was cool. He messed me on Twitter about Hollow Knight, and I was checking out his channel. He's got some serious. Uh, he's changed his whole channel into Hollow Knight stuff. I'll tell you how much there is to this game. We've only fought the first boss. I'll get into it. And I'll figure out how the map works and. Yeah. This pretty much will replace Neo. I think Neo 2 is supposed to be coming out this year or something. 
Dragon Quest Builders 2. Yeah, people get into those games. It's cool. Got a 4.6. Ah, okay. Still, you'd still feel that. I suppose, see, there's different types of earthquakes, right? I think if you're closer to the epicenter, even a 4.6 would be pretty big, yeah? And you're further away, it's like the reverberation kind of wears off a bit. We, I think we, there's little mini earthquake. I think it was one in Donegal, but it's nothing, like, you know? We finished Neo DLC. I finished off the second one, I think it was. And I said, look, I'm going to leave it there because it's just, it's, um, it's too much. It's weirdly artificially difficult, and I can't seem to figure out what they want from me at all. So I'm like, it's okay. If I if I think if I play the rest of it, I will end up hating it. You know, I don't want to do that. It's all good. The level, the weird mission level stuff keeps going up. 15 levels every mission, but they only give you enough uh, Amrita to level up once or twice, maybe. It costs like five million Amrita. So if they're leveling up 15 levels every time, I mean, what the fuck are you supposed to do? Anyway, it's 20 miles. You slept through Oh, A lot of people seem to do that. I know it's like, when it comes to like, hurricanes, tornadoes, earthquakes, volcanoes, it's always one of the, maybe not volcanoes, but it's always one of those things that, like, ooh, you watch movies and stuff, especially over here where nothing really happens. You watch movies and that, and you're kind of living, like, oh, I'd love to see that, I'd love to be a storm chase and all this kind of stuff. And you know, not whether it's news or movies or shows, or whatever. They never show the, the true devastation. It ruins people's lives forever. So, yeah, it's all well and good thinking like that. It's only when you hear people's stories and people telling you things, and you're like, you just kind of you take a whole different look at it. Yeah, did a bit of Neo. Neo was fantastic, I think just, I don't know, oh with the, oh maybe the DLC, yeah, I just, I don't know, I think, I, I looked it up and it said it doesn't, but it feels like it levels up with you, because even the normal mobs are doing 4,000 damage, see what, the thing with the DLC is they want you to do that, uh, exotic weapons, and there's some other level above that per lesson or something, it's kind of like how Borderlands works, except they don't drop like that, you have to grind and grind it out. Maybe I got time for that. Tornadoes. We have. Yeah, yeah. That seems to be it. It's like, what was it called? Tornado Alley or something like that. Pretty insane. Is it this time of year that happens as well with the heat and the cold and all that? Fucking insane. You guys stay safe. So here, like, Rester is over. He was pretty close to them. Fucking insane. I know Ghoulie had a bit of a hurricane as well coming in from, like, Florida and that. Going to Louisiana, like, fuck, fuck that. March, April, and May, yeah. And then it comes back around maybe like September or something, isn't it? It's mad. When you, when you look at how tornadoes are formed and that, it's insane. Like, it's. Same with hurricanes as well. It's like the earth trying to balance itself out. Get them in June, July, yeah. Jesus. I always like talk about the movie Twister, like, that's all I fucking know of it, you know? It's not got to do with anything. <laughs> yeah, we get, we got like a little small one. I don't know. See, we're not near any of the faults or anything with the earthquakes and that. This is very common music. Playing around in the leaves. With the pop rocks. Yeah, it was a good movie, but kind of unrealistic, uh, right? Some bits were really cool. I always remember that bit at the drive-thru. Uh, where everybody's watching a movie outside. I think it was The Shining, actually. I'm nearly sure it was The Shining. And it's pitch black as nighttime. And there's a tornado forming behind it. Big beast to be open. And it just rips the whole theater up. Outdoor thing. That was fucking crazy. The cow and the 18 wheeler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love the, um, what were they called? Dorothy. The little machines they have with all the little sensors in them. That was really cool. I think that was semi based on real technology. That who was that Bill was that Bill Paxton? I think he passed away now. He's passed away a little while. It was a Bill Pullman. I always get those two mixed up and it's fucked up. Yeah, it was Bill Paxton. Damn. Damn, is he already dead two years? Fucking hell, where's the time gone? He wasn't even that old. 
What's the matter? Your time is your time, right? I forget he's in the Titanic. He's a good actor, and it sucks. Alright, I won't keep you guys any longer. I was just on Twitter there a second. You're still not feeling the best, Swampy. That's all good, dude. Take your time, you know. When you're back, you're back. I'll be there. That sucks, dude. You're saying maybe that can work as well. Sometimes that happens. It's like a bug. You get it from someone. You know, fucked up. Then you come back in and someone else gets it. And it just keeps repeating itself. Filthy bastards at work. <laughs> oh, Jesus. And where do you work? I work in a hospital. What? Doctors don't wash their hands when they're inside somebody. Damn, that's a, that's a nice Cajun chicken sandwich you got there. This isn't Cajun. Oh, my God. Same symptoms. Yeah, yeah. Someone, someone's spreading it. It might be an old change of season cold anyway. I hope you feel better, dude. I appreciate you guys coming through, though. Thank you, Swampy. Thank you, old guy. Ghouly ghouls, as always. Pyro. Queenie, everybody today. Fire Lily. Thank you so much, everyone. Oh, I'm plugged as well. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. You guys are awesome. Oh, JJ and Dynamite. I, I'm just running through. I still can't fix Twitch chat, but I will one day. I'll hold it in place. Yeah. Keep telling I'm not shit on the. Oh god. <laughs> There's always one place. Oh, you should see the pubs in this in Ireland. I gave them a toss. Come to the Irish pubs. It's like yeah, come to the Irish pubs. Stay away from the Irish pub toilets. My god. It's like are you aiming for the fucking wall or what? <laughs> How do you see what? What got on the stream? What? Oh, Jesus. Oh, who? I don't know, I'm just scrolling up through chat, that's all. I have the chat window popped out the whole stream on the side, so I can scroll back as far as it'll go until it starts eating the messages, you know? That's all. I wish there was better ways. Like, I, I used to be able to stop it from scrolling, now it scrolls. And then, like you're saying, you're probably meaning, like, you refresh it, you do lose... Whatever way the Twitch servers work, it's a devil, I hate that. Something I wish they'd fix. I do find little shortcuts around it, like if you press back, sometimes it won't get rid of the chat. Yeah. Thought there was some... I wish there was a magical window. It probably is somewhere. Story about people pissing on the floor, we'll save that for another day. There you go. Imagine piss... Yeah, yeah, uh, alright. Good. See, now we have something to talk about next time, so... That's all that matters, right? <laughs> alright, cheers guys, have a great night. I'll catch you all in the next one. Cheers! <laughs>